Hey everyone and welcome back to Let's Play the Incredible Machine! Even more contraptions or something like that. Home cooking! Mel needs some help making lunch. Mel. Open the can of soup, toast the bread, and start the mixer. Sounds nice. So we're making some food. Also, uh, I should be hiding the hands. Something goes there. No shit. Oh, also, Mel just starts booking it. Huh. Well, Curry the cat over here sounds like an interesting idea, although the mouse does not seem to see. There you go. Okay, well, that just works. Now, what else? I could plug this in here, which is going to make this spin in whatever direction, which I suppose is going to uh, allow. God damn it. I can't put it too far because then it won't be plugged. Yeah. There. God damn it. Well, this is gonna have to do. Can't put it. Can't put it closer than that. Also, I don't really know. You need light to get this one going. Oh, dude, I get it. I can plug this here. And then I don't know which way I need to turn this to actually make it turn the that thing over there, so we'll just try this and see what happens. Hey, it all works. Cool. I figure your your the solution is the same. To go supernova. Oh no! The people in the silver rocket escape. Right. Where's the? This is a silver rocket. That's a complicated way to escape, but whatever. Um. So this is going. Okay. This is going to light the rocket, which is going to get this going. Needs to go up, I would assume. Up and over here, where it will go wherever. I don't actually know. Uh, let's just start it and see where it goes. I'm not even sure where. It goes. Wow, you're slow. All right, you go tennis ball. You're gonna go here. Okay, I assume we need the wind to actually blow into this, which is going to turn this, uh, for a little amount of time, this thing, which we can then, uh, I don't know, tie to this. This is a thing, this goes left to right, and that makes this thing turn a little from side to side. I mean, it's going to turn this way, and then that way. But then, you know, it's going to all start, all stop turning very quickly, so I don't really know what's going to happen, actually. So they're sacrificing a mouse. Terrible for the mouse. Poor Newton. There we go. Goodbye, Silver Rocket. You, well, actually, you won't be missed. The planet will, though. Also, planets don't go supernova. Their stars do, though. It's Newton Mouse's dinner time. Oh. Feed him some hot cheese. Hot? Why does it, does it... Oh. It's going to be hot because fire. I guess. Also, does anything happen if I do this? The cat is carried there. And then it goes after the mice. Which then escapes. And cuts a balloon. Very well, then. I need to pull on this. Which should be manageable by just doing something like this with this. Basically the same principle as last time. We just need to... Uh, actually, I'm going to put that here. Because then it's going to go down before going up. Right? That means it needs to be here. And then going down, it's going to pull on this. Which is all I really need. The rest is just there for the sake of being there, I suppose. Hmm. Okay. Let's see if that actually works. It does. Hey! Oh, right. There was also the part where I needed him to get to the cheese. Thankfully, that just did itself. Mel carried all of his aquariums to the ocean. Oh. Can you help him set his fish it's free? It's another break all the aquariums. 
Well, that seems simple enough. The balloon, I imagine, will be pulling on strings. I don't really get what's going to... What this cheese is going to do. Or this, for that matter. Also, I'm not sure what's going to break these. Maybe a mouse is going to fall over, I don't know. We need to find out what happens when... Oh, I know! This is a balloon! This is not a sun! Uh, this reverses gravity, by the way. It doesn't just make things float. It reverses gravity. So in this case, it's gonna make it go down. And that's how you do that. Now then, I also need... ...something to be pulled. Hold on. This is going to activate the button. Believe me. We're gonna put a pulley or trolley or whatever it's called over here. An ice... Uh, not ice. Uh, iron thread or whatever. How do you call that even? I don't know. Anyway. It's neither... I it's steel. Steel wire. There you go, I got it. To pull on this. Which should pull it down, yes. Alright, this should work, I think. Nice! I mean, the explosion was nice looking, with all the Newton mouse, mouse go mice sure going like everywhere. Chow down on some cheese. Can right. you get Newton to his dinner using only these pipes and accelerator tubes? I uh, imagine I can, otherwise there's no solution to this, which would be kind of terrible. Alright, I suppose we're gonna start with a redirection pipe, like so. With this. And then I suppose I'll need to redirect him this way. And then this way, and then let's throw him over there. Uh, this mice mouse is very trusting of me because, ooh, god. These alligators are making it a little dicey. Let's see. Hume. Hume. Okay, this is going to need another one of these. Right here, and it's going to start to shoot over there. Alright. I'll need to bring it back up. I wonder if this is gonna be enough. I mean... jeez. Oh, okay, maybe if we do this... Although that's two accelerators just to do this. So I'm not quite sure about that. Maybe I need to put it... Maybe I need to put it more like this. Um, maybe one more up? And like this, and like this, and then maybe the last accelerator between these. I don't know if that's gonna work or not. Oof! Barely. Yeah! Okay, I'm curious, what's their solution? Okay, this one they didn't, like, make it go down slightly. Also, this is completely different. Well. Different approaches, but it kind of worked either way, so... Not too bad. Not too bad. Next contraption. Help Newton pop all of his birthday balloons and nibble on his cheese. Sounds nice. I need to pop all the balloons. Um... What do I have that pops balloons? Explosives, I'm guessing? Which is kind of silly, but okay. Nothing happens. Okay, well if I put the cheese here, it's going to get this guy moving and falling down on this while exploding this. 
That only breaks one of the balloons in there, though. So I'm not sure what's up with that. So this is supposed to pull on something, clearly. Um, possibly one of these to make something explode. And then I guess the laser is supposed to... You know, get this moving. I mean, the laser is going to be plugged in here for sure. And this is one of the plugs where you need to get this rolling to actually get electricity in here. So this little guy is going to be necessary to get this going. And then this laser is going to be shooting somewhere and I don't know where. I'm thinking maybe in here because this does not pop everything in here. If you know what I mean. You probably do. Uh, I don't know honestly how to do this. I don't even know where I want to put everything, that's the thing. I'll want explosives. Oh uh, no. Never mind. I had an idea, it was a bad idea. Maybe... no. You see, if I, if I could light this with this laser, that'd be kind of great. At the same time, not really. No, I can't. At least I'm not sure I can. I'm not sure how that would be possible. I don't know! I'm lost and confused. Give me a moment. I think that's it! Boom! I don't know if he nibbled on cheese though. He didn't. God damn it. Newton! Get the cheese! You're bad at this! Get the damn cheese! This should do it. Yes, he nibbled! That's all I needed. What's their solution is what I wonder. Right, right. Only one of that is necessary? That's surprising. How do you get this to trigger then? Oh, brilliant. No, really, it's brilliant. I like it. Alright. Get Curry to her cat box quick! Quick, eh? Is that her quack? I have her, her quack. Sure. Her cat box. So this is going to trigger everything, I take it. Why are there nails in the wall? I don't know. So this looks like an obvious spot for this. Let's make it instantaneous. To hit this thing, which is going to... Um, get this going? Possibly, maybe, perhaps? Which will, um, well, pull on this, clearly. I just don't know how it's going to manage that. Does it need to be there? It doesn't. Alright, let's put this right here, and then this right here. I don't know why I would put it there. Anyway, this is going to explode this, which can power this thing. Oh, it needs to be this side. I cannot reverse the side of it, which is surprising. Most things you can. So this is going to get you going towards your mouse buddy, I would hope. Which is going to get her down there. I assume that's how that's going to work. It was! The males got out of the wall, too, while we're Newton's at it. Newton's got a hankering for some fish with his cheese. Okay. Help him break Mel's aquarium to get the fish. Then make sure he gets to eat Newton. his delectable cheese. Really? Break this and then eat this with the mouse. Um, well, I assume I could do something like this. And there's a generator here, which allows you to do this. So it's kind of self-powered. And then that's going to throw it over there. 
think, I think. No. Oh, I'm dumb. Alright. You put it kind of here. I think. Oh no, this needs to be up there. This, this needs to be here. God damn it. Where can you put it? I don't know how this is gonna break. Hold on. I think I'm doing it wrong. Hold on. This goes here to get it going over there, and then it's going to... down there. Okay, so I'm going to assume... This is going that this is gonna go somewhere there, and then I can do this. Which is going to power this. I don't have very many tools to do this, so... Can I reverse? I can reverse? No. Um... God damn it. You are going to do this. Really? What am I supposed to do with you? Oops. Uh, no, 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 no. Not this way. God damn it! That's right on it! And it didn't really trigger him. Maybe this one? Yay! Alright, that kind of works. I assume that's the solution because there aren't very many ways you could possibly do this. Help Although Mel I should have checked the where they put it. Rockets off the top of the screen. Two silver rockets off the top of the screen. So you need to launch this to open the way. I take it. So ideally we pull on this first. The eight ball is going to stay there, of course. This triggers the everything. Oh, wow. It really does. Where does the 8-ball go? It is you. Um, this is going to have to be the thing that pulls on you. I don't necessarily know how. But you will. And this is going to trigger this one. And something needs to trigger this. I can only assume this is it. Um, I need the mouse to get going. Mel could probably do that. Yeah, Mel probably needs to do that, in fact. Because nothing's triggering this. Let's do this for now, see what happens. Alright. Or maybe I need to put this in this thing's path. Oh, that one's gone. Do you trigger this or not? Do I need to alter the eight balls path? Oh, okay, that's gonna go. I just don't have anything really... Okay, well, actually, the eight ball needs to... I don't know how to trigger you. It's my biggest issue here. Hmm. I've used all my things though. I don't see what else I could be doing. I mean, I can't put it there, can I? What good would that do? Something needs to bump this. This looks like it. I just need to bump the button. I don't really have a way to do that. Oh, God. And something needs to bump Mel if he's going to do this.
I don't really see that happening right now. Wow, I'm actually... Oops. I actually don't know. That's a first to me. Dude, maybe? No, that's not it. Because he goes the wrong way, that's the problem. Maybe if I do this. I don't actually know. I'm just trying stuff. Because that's the best I got right now. He's just trying stuff out. That does not look very promising. He's just stuck there. Dang it. I don't know. Don't. How should I know? What does that do? I'm almost willing to look at hands because I really don't know. God damn it, what triggers you? I don't know how to trigger this one. This thing is in the way. I just remembered the solution. That was a remember. This thing triggers this thing, which shoves him. There we go. And then it triggers that. And then I did not um, actually trigger the first explosion, which is probably the most important one, because then they can't leave otherwise. There we go. Everything's working. I just realized that. All right, next contraption. Mel's mouse buddies have been trapped in the kelp by Otto the octopus. Hmm. Help Mel free his little buddies and feed them some cheese. After okay. that, help Mel head home to his underwater bungalow and turn on his lava lamp. And the lava, that's very important. The lava lamp is very important. You need to pull on it with ropes. Okay, what happens here? That is a very weird thing over here. And it just kind of goes. I kind of remember this one being weird because if this is going, and if the uh, conveyor belt on under the conveyor belt is going this way, he's going to actually walk his way over there. Which is kind of silly if you ask me, but whatever. This is actually going to work. Now, we're going to need him to pull on this and then pull on this. Which, I don't, I'm not sure how, actually. Hold on. Just making sure that this is gonna work. It is? That's just kind of weird, by the way. And then it glitches out. And that's actually the solution. Also, this looks like a spot for you. So, see, this guy is going to trigger this thing. Please turn around, thank you. Which is going to pull on the lamp, because why not? This is going to pull on it. I just need to get it rolling, right? And then this one uh, is going to pull on the button over here. I would assume. Here we go. I don't know why the basketball is floating up. Don't ask me. Do not. I have zero clue. This one is just weird. And that makes it memorable, which is why I remember the solution from way back when I did that. Oh my god, gravity is weird. I don't know what that noise is, and I don't really care. I'm going to end it here, it's a little short, but I don't have much time to actually play this today. It's, which is unfortunate, but it just, Click on the that's just the way it goes sometimes. So. We did 10 of them today. Next time, if I have enough time, we may finish all of them because there's only 15 left and I've done 15 first. So that's all of the easies. Maybe. Hopefully. We'll see. Until then, see y'all.